Hello, this is Jason Gore from Canada. Ruben, we could talk about Thorstein Veblen and consumption and Hegel and Marx, and we can go a deep philosophical dive, but I want to talk about how your film is really fucking funny. Great. <laughs> and, and, and I want to talk about this, because I think people come to Ken looking for films that are serious and not realizing that funny is smart. And so if you could talk about as a director of bringing incredibly intensely philosophical ideas to a framework of entertainment, and as performance, especially Woody in particular, you've made a career of showing that sometimes stupid can be very smart. And that sometimes being clever, <laughs> and, that, and, that, and, that, and that underneath it all. But as performance, if you could talk about setting that line that, that you're not going too far, that you're taking something serious and seeing the silliness, but also taking the silliness and showing that sometimes it's life and death. Lots of questions, but if the, uh, first the director and then the performance, if we could talk about but finding that balance. Thank you so much for asking that question, because I think that have been a goal for, for us with this film, that we wanted to create like a roller coaster for adults. And, uh, something that is entertaining and challenging and funny and to really use the cinema for what it's it's to use for you know like to have an experience together and when you leave the cinema afterwards you should be like what what have happened you know and you have something to talk about and we wanted to get the way of, like we were doing test screenings, you know, and I wanted to get the way from the audience that is sitting like this, hmm, now I should react in a smart way because someone is watching me, you know, uh, yeah, and then afterwards like, hmm, yeah, the film have a problem, you know, uh, uh, and I wanted to bring in an audience, I was doing uh, test screenings, we were doing in Berlin and in Stockholm, and now also on the countryside in Spain, and it was so great to go to the countryside of Spain, where we had uh, 30 people, uh, that have no experience of cinema and just bring them in and they were like laughing and screaming straight out and you know and I was like finally you know an audience that is uh, giving something back and I think that we also have to remind ourselves that we Europeans are very often not a good audience we sit with our arms crossed like this and like okay let's see what happens and we forget that we are part of the show we are part of the performance so when you go to US and have screenings there the audience is like wow and okay, then you can talk about the content of the film, but we, we have a responsibility to create the great screening. And that was so beautiful yesterday. Uh, uh, it was so beautiful because people were applauding during like, it was a football game, someone told me. It was a football <laughs> game going on. And when uh, Dolly's character is like taking over the control, they're like, yeah. <laughs> no, no, yeah. Uh, so, and, and this is the goal with the movies that we're going to make in the future also. We are combining the best part of the European cinema that is intellectual, that is trying to say something about society with the best part of the American cinema that is like, okay, if we don't make this film successful, we don't have any job anymore and we can't support our children and they can't go to college, you know, like this, this two kind of pressure and really create cinema that makes it like, fucking, I want to go to the cinema. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Applaud. Yeah.